All right, Paul Howe, see that way. Question came in, uh, good question. Did you see the enemy? Uh, what's happened is, uh, looks like uh, somebody from the Citadel and reading a lot of history about they really rarely saw anyone to shoot at. Times have changed now in uh, different scenarios. So what we've got is uh, we defend. So short term, long term, maybe hasty. And what that means is long term, you might be on a base. So you're watching. You're watching the indige. You might be in, have population out there coming and going on your bases now. Things have changed. And then sometimes there are no hard lines. You have to watch for demeanor. So you can defend long term. You can see, and then one player one day may show up with an AK. Or they may come in mass, get off a vehicle. They may infiltrate at night. So, yes, you generally do see. The uh, short term, for example, the crash site, uh, 12, 18 hours on the ground, uh, securing a helicopter. Yes, saw the enemy. Uh, had to move to the site, secure the site, come off site. Saw enemy mostly going to and on the site. Exfilling, not so much. But, yes, plain as day. Now, when I say... Saw them daytime, saw them nighttime. Uh, visual, uh, I've had other missions where I used MVGs and let people walk into your position because you didn't want, nobody has started a ruckus yet. When I say a ruckus gunfire, it's all quiet. And some of these folks are formulating their plan and they're moving to their pre-planned battle positions and they may walk through your position to get there. So you may be the one engaging, starting all the noise because everything is quiet. A lot of people think, well, once I see the first one, uh, I'm going to shoot. A lot of times, that's not the right answer. Let them come in deep where they can't get away, then open up with as many weapons as you can on them, and then that puts a damper on their plans. So a blocking position is you may have a group go in to do something, and you may have a short-term blocking position that may last, well, five minutes. So you're blocking to prevent either people coming off target or people reacting to the target. So it can be short term. Yes, you'll see them come. It's very obvious. Uh, push to contact. The SOG guys, Vietnam, talked to a lot of them. What they would do is go out there and they try to observe first, but a lot of times they would bump into the enemy. They'd dump a bunch of rounds, pull back, call for airstrikes. And so a lot of different variables there. And a lot of times they're running while they're doing this. And so push through to an objective. Sometimes uh, you've dropped off or you're pushing on foot or you're moving on vehicles. And I've had to get off vehicles and move on foot because the vehicle couldn't make it because of the hazards or, or obstructions in the road. So you can move too. Now, in those positions, yes, you see them. It's very obvious. Now, if you don't see a human being you know, with a weapon, you see muzzle flashes. You learn to recognize an AK versus an AR type platform. It's one of those things that uh, I think we see the enemy more when you're moving, uh, pushing to an enemy objective, old school, they're going to camouflage those. So you really won't see them till they, they open up on you. But uh, I, I kind of peeked through all the old uh, footage, you know, whether it be World War II, Korea, Vietnam, to see, try to get a, a, a capture what they saw. I think today uh, we, we see a lot more. That's just my two cents. So I hope this helps you. I'm trying to go down my list. Uh, yeah. So you'll see the enemy. Uh, you just got to keep your head up, your eyes open. Hope this helps you. Appreciate the question. You take care. Be safe. Hi, right, Paul Howe, CSAT Way. I want to thank you folks for watching all our channels. So we have the YouTube. We have free content on the CSAT Way Facebook. If you want precision shooting uh, techniques go to the patreon csat patreon site for training we have dedicated we have private training we have regularly scheduled classes so you just let us know what you're interested in and we can help you out we look forward to seeing you folks on the range you take care be safe